Yes, we're back. We're back again for another first look at a new game, and this time it's Grand Casino Tycoon. I've not got any further than this intro screen, so I'll be seeing this for the first time as you see it for the first time. Grab that guidebook to all things casino-y that's grand, and let's go! So hi there, Steve here, and yes, welcome to Grand Casino Tycoon. If you're new to my videos, then welcome indeed. This going out on what I call Random Sunday, a day that I use to put first looks at new games, some of which can be quite random. Uh, if they end up being good, though, they go into the normal mix of games, which for me is OMSI on a Monday, Trains on a Wednesday, uh, on a Friday currently rotating between some firm bus, tourist bus, and farming. Uh, on a Saturday, some trucking, and then, yes, some other stuff goes out, out on a Tuesday or Thursday if it becomes regular series, but Random Sunday is where we put first looks. So, let's click any key to continue, then. Ah, there you are. It's been more than a year. Where have you been all this time? I have a new job for you. Help me manage my newly built casinos and drain some rich kids of their daddy's money. Take it all and give it to those who really need it. Me. More than a year? I, I've not played the game before. I don't know where I've been for a year then, but we'll click on next. I know you already know this, but let's go through the controls anyway. I don't. Move the camera using WASD, or by holding the right mouse button. Rotate it with the middle mouse button. You know the drill. Use the scroll wheel to zoom in on every beautiful detail of our casino. Okay, got that. Well, right now it's rather empty here. Let's change that. My market research team put together a checklist of objects which our potential guests will want to have. These are the requirements for a gambler type. Let's get building. Go on and open the build menu. Okay. Let's first build the items in the requirements to lure in our first guests. Okay, so gambling slots, I'm guessing. Okay. So we'll put these up against the wall here then. Do I mean we need? How much money have we got? 302,000. Four seems good. Can we rotate them? Uh, oh, R is rotate. Uh huh. Okay, so let's put some back to back. There we go. Uh, have any regular bar okay drinks bars cocktail okay can we put a bar let's put a bar in then does that just go up against the wall here I'm guessing oh no it can't as it can okay have any bar table so I put a bar table in up here then I'm going to zoom out so far let's go a little bit more so rotate that. Okay, bar table. Uh, have any business buffet? Sandwich, rustic food table. So sandwich, and then I'm guessing food table. Let's rotate that then. We'll go the same way as that one. And have a toilet. Well, that's inconvenient. Uh, room dividers, toilets. We've got to put this inside the or can this go outside no it's actually got to go in the room okay um we'll pop that down in the corner good here then we built everything this gambler type expects from a casino unpause the game now and watch our sheep our esteemed guests flock into our casino <laughs> okay unpause the game here they are I can already hear the sweet clinking of money entering our slot machines. Even old Gerard showed up. Just watch. He'll go straight to the slot machines and then turn to the wine bar. If he even fits between those one-armed bandits. Why would you want to go between them? Each gambler type has their VIP, like old Gerard here. 
that act as ambassadors for their like-minded gamblers. Okay. Here, you can see how happy that specific gambler type is with each aspect of our casino. The happier they are in each category, the more gamblers of this type will visit our casino. Okay. Go and improve the happiness of Gerard and his friends by adding some decoration to the casino. Me and Gerard here, we go way back. Unlike me, he went all famous actor after our dealings in Russia. Bad idea. Now, he's one of the slot zombies. They drink wine and only play the noisy slot machines. Okay. Uh, if you're watching this on... Uh, well, you're caught watching this on YouTube. If you're new to my content, it's been one of those. Uh, then there will be a couple of links in the description below. Firstly, to where you can buy the game. Uh, I'll, that'll be linked below. Uh, secondly, a link to the Twitch page. I live stream on Twitch six days of the week. Uh, all sorts of content there. So do check out the Twitch page as well. And a link to the Discord server. An awesome community on Discord for sim games and random games and all kinds of stuff. Uh, so check those out. Those will be in the description down below. Right, so got to add in decorations now. Floors, room dividers, decoration. Okay. A balloon bouquet. Because, well, why not add in a balloon bouquet? So we'll put that. There. That's a noise. Uh, right in the way. The next game will be my great win. What's the okay, we'll stick in a floor lamp. Right where they come in. I'll light up the area. Uh, a column, because why not? A vase. We'll pop that there. A card statue? Yeah, why not put a card statue in up against the wall there? Okay. So is it telling us what I've got to uh, actually put in? Or just keep going then until they're happy, I'm guessing? Surprise! Room divider? I want a room divider. Well, that's decoration. That's all I can do, isn't it? Um, I could build more slots, I'm guessing. why not put some more slot machines in there we go we did say decoration well, we got to wait and get their popularity is up 50 percent oh, so we can see the gambling we can turn that one on to show the ambiance <laughs> i cannot stop playing i love it So what point is Matey Boy going to come back then and tell me what to, else to do? Wild boar roast, my favourite. A wild boar roast, indeed. Why not? I'll build decorations, six of eight. I've just spotted that at the top there. So I've got to put a couple of bit more, more decoration in. Seven. Put another plant in up here in this corner. Excellent. There we go. Now let's add some music to our casino. You wouldn't believe how easy it is to manipulate people with music. Okay. Just make sure to use the correct music. Thankfully, people post all the info we need on social media. I put it into the trait section of each gambler type. Study it and build a few music speakers. Okay, so we've got to build four music speakers. Okay, music. Club music, funky music, soothing music. Hate soothing music. Love funky music. Okay, so funky music then. Uh -huh. 
two, three, four. Good. You can never have too many decorations or speakers, but keep in mind each object has a running cost. Okay. The only way to see how our sheep uh, gamblers like the new decorations and music is to wait for their feedback. Time is money, so let's speed it up. Set the game speed to four times. Awesome. While we're waiting, I'll grab a quick afternoon scotch. But you'd better keep improving our casino. When we reach 60% popularity with those gamblers, I'll show you another trick. Okay. So, I it. The next game will be my great win. so if I add in some more slot machines, let's put some down here. Straight out of the toilet. Popularity is now going down, though. That's that's not a good thing, really, is it? Yeah, popularity is falling. We need to <laughs> we need to get the popularity up, really, not not down. Let's uh, add in some more decorations. Bit of lighting. Oh wow, it's going down at twenty-three percent. Oh, we don't. Another casino to explore. Hello. Add in some uh, food tables and drinks tables. Oh, it's it's hovering forty percent. Okay, so casino building may not be my thing. Oh, 40, 42. I've got to go to, got to go to 60. 48. Oh, it's come back down again. My Russian friend would love it to see. Great decoration. So the ambiance they don't like. Trouble in decorations, they're frequent. Okay. So it's decorations they want then. Because of the uh, ambiance. Enough play for today. Back to my menu business. Uh, bye. Oh, someone's uh, vanished. Put a couple of big dice in the way. It seems to be blocking the way to our... Uh, our things now. On. They've got statue, they've got dice, they've got balloons. Stood near a smelly toilet for too long. Okay, so they don't need the. Actually, perhaps they don't like the um, the things near the toilet then. But sadly, you can just come straight out and gamble. Perhaps I, I should move those away Hello? from the toilet. Just one more game of this slot machine. Okay. Uh, move wall. I want the jackpot. This will make my Russian friend very so happy. is it that those... Let's take those away from there then. And move them a bit. Good. Good. Our casino becomes more and more popular as a gambler's happiness increases. Time to take it to the next level. Okay. A larger casino attracts more gamblers. So... Let's buy a new lot and expand our casino. To buy a lot, open the build menu and click one of the lot signposts which marks the area directly outside our casino walls. 
Ah, uh, more space. Do you hear that? It must be my, um, our wallet, cheering with joy. Although, the increased rent makes it sad. Well, I see it as an investment in our future. Because with this much free real estate, we can attract another gambler type. Oh. So, let's find out what we need to build to lure them in. Select the locked gambler type to see its unlock requirements. Huh. Gotcha. They want objects we currently can't build. I'll take care of it this time. But first, let's look at their traits. Always check the traits first before unlocking a new gambler type. That way, we will know how to plan our casino. Okay, so they want low stakes tables, bar, fancy buffet. As you can see, the posh gambler hates noisy slots and yelling gamblers. Yeah. Thankfully, I got some new video poker machines. They don't make any noise. Place them in the new lot, far away from the noisy slots and our yelling slot zombies. Okay, so we come over to here and we place the new video poker machines. Great. Before we continue, we should make sure none of our yelling slot zombies uses the video poker machines. Oh. You see, our gamblers are, let's say, stubborn. When they want to play slots, they will go to the closest slot machine. But if there is no free slot machine close by, they will walk through the whole casino to find one. Well done. This should make sure the slot zombies stay in their part of the casino. I'm guessing that was something to say out to have a minimum amount. Now, we just need to get the posh gamblers to play at the video poker machines. Let's look at their routine to find a way. Remember, our gamblers are mindless sheep. They have a routine and stick to it. They always start with the topmost activity and continue down the list. When they reach the end, they start again from the top. Looks like you always grab a drink first. Okay. So the best thing would be to place a bar close to the video poker machines. Don't forget the bar tables. Okay, so build a luxury bar. Champagne bar. Blimey. Well, I suppose if you're winning big. Good. Build the remaining objects close to the bar, and we can finally greet our new, um, guest. Ideally, you should keep the walking distance short, as less walking means more spending. Ah. Oh, what do you mean to do that? Right, so we're going to unlock our posh gamblers now. But they require low stakes tables. So I'm guessing there's going to be, oh, there is table. Low stakes tables. I'll put that up here in the corner. And a fancy buffet. Seafood. I wouldn't say seafood's fancy, but okay, well, no, we'll go with that. Put that up there. Make them happy and empty their pockets. You know what to do. Build decorations and music speakers. Okay, Boomer. It's Austin Powders on a mission. The same mission all posh gamblers are on. Getting their party on. Play that funky music. Okay. Uh, let's put a table in there tonight. So, okay, so hate club music, love funky music. So we can put some more speakers in. Yeah, 
and put some decorations. Uh, okay. Put a lamp in the corner. Put a lamp there. Trap the barman in. There we go. Reach popularity of sixty uh, percent again. Could probably build some more uh, poker slots. Let's do that. Put them down here. And put some decoration behind them. That was a noise. Oh, popularity is going up though. 47%. So the posh people this side, the uh, not so posh people this side. I think we can speed that time up a bit. Build some more sexy in Here's my room number, baby. Okay. The food portions are rather small, I have to say. Small. Plant there. Manifi, a jackpot, a glass of the taxi. I feel it. The next game will be my great win. Basically, just fill in the blanks so that they end up looking. Uh... Well, nice. The decorations done most of the way around. Fifty-six percent. So a few bits that are not liking the decorations on. No one seems to be playing the card tables. I'm back and the game is on. Rock and roll, baby. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Just one drink. Mission in progress, baby. Doesn't seem to be going up. Money seems to be going. Okay. It's up and the down. Game will be my great win. Room divider in. Separates out the uh, the cheap side from the posh side. Let's try adding a few more decorations in then while we're trying to get it up. I don't like the cheap balloons. Just one more game of this slot machine. What else I can do now to try and get the, the thing up? Card statue thing? I'm going to get to 60%. Another casino to explore. Hello. 59. Come on, one more percent. Oh, 57. Just one more game of this slot machine. 59. Yeah, I've been fine. Maybe I'll stay a bit longer. There we go. So, done. And there we go. That's probably a... Uh, a good time to uh, end this little first look so got it up to 59 or 60 percent and uh, made my casino um, rock basically 
Uh, that's not bad. I think the idea with having sort of goals and stuff is uh, is quite cool. Um, and uh, certainly this could be something you could spend some time in. Uh, so there we go. We will end there. Don't forget to check out those links in the description below. One to the game where you can pick it up and play it for yourself. One to the Twitch page where you can watch me live on Twitch six days of the week. And one to that Discord server where you can join in with an awesome community over there on Discord. So don't forget to hit subscribe for more stuff from me. And until the next time, if you have been, thanks very, very much for watching. I'm back and the game is on. Rock and roll, baby, yeah.